Welcome to the Tom Museum of Art. I'm Cindy Peterson, the Executive Director. And I'm Patrick Shawkett, Deputy Director of Exhibitions and Collections. And we just popped out of a Tierra Donovan. Well, literally, behind. We weren't inside, <laughs> I promise. How else would this be here? Uh, and that's part of this intriguing work is how it's constructed. There's no adhesive. It's all toothpicks, just regular straight toothpicks that are held together by density. They've been really packed within a mold and then the mold's removed, the wooden mold. And density, gravity, uh, and part of the work too, with the charm of the work, it's a cube, obviously made out of toothpicks of all things. But part of it is, is continually losing a toothpick maybe here or there a day so that it's in very slow motion disintegration. And when it arrived at the Taubin from the from the lender, it was in multiple, multiple uh, boxes of tubs, all of the toothpicks and all of the straight pins with the directions and the forms on how to uh, install with that permission, of course, from the artist in the gallery to do so. And with the warning, of course, that it could take multiple times to, to get it to work correctly. And that was, you know, as we put on the form, we do have a time lapse of it. And so as we put that form on, we took it away. It was really holding our breath to see was it going to stay or not. And this one we actually ended up doing twice because it, we wanted to give it another try. It wasn't exactly exactly perfect. And so we made some adjustments. And this artist here, Donna, and she's in Brooklyn. She's known for often really large scale installations of ordinary objects that are transformed by repetition often. For example, she did a whole cloud series made of styrofoam cups. But what I love about this and the other one you'll see later, maybe straight pins, but these are just toothpicks. But if you notice, when you look closely at a given side, they almost look like they start to curve and weave like straw. But they're, they're, they're all, even um, though they're scrunched together, they all are still very straight. It's just the kind of visual kind of phenomenon that happens when they get close together that makes you want to start seeing almost like curved uh, weaving there. And I, I love the questions because yes. number one you can see it from the outside of our building as you're walking yes. down the pathway but you can also see it of course on the inside and wondering what it is as as you get further away and the light is different you might think of different things oh yeah same with this one it's straight pins so again sometimes it looks like some kind of weird resin you spray on resin that attaches together like fake hair or uh, a really bristly fur coat but and then sometimes in the bright sunshine uh, it'll just scintillate with like diamond like points of light uh, so you know this straight pin one too was a challenge because we didn't know as we filled and kept filling and, and knocking on the on the form so that they would you know continue to go down into that form and then taking it off we didn't know for sure how it was going to look like and you know it, part of the art is that the pins and straight pins and the toothpicks fall off gradually yes um, but that takes years and years and years as i saw it installed it was over 10 years and it was it looked almost new Wow. Uh, we, we look forward to sharing these two works of art from Tara Donovan. You yes. can see them from the outside of our theater lobby as well as on the inside.